All right, this isn't like an official review episode. It's just kind of like a supplemental, just cause uh, I have this box of random like candy and food and stuff that I have had for like a year probably. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna bang through it, uh, except for this one. I'm still gonna hold on to this one. Uh, we, we got the cup noodles breakfast. Um, I mean, this is never gonna expire, right? What does that say? Oh, it is expire. Actually, it expires um, soon. So maybe I'll actually do this uh, like right now. Not right now, but like I might do this in a different video. So look out for. Uh, Cup noodles breakfast. I've never had ramen, so uh, this would be the first time, and it's probably not the best time to do it. Um, uh, these, these I got a while ago uh, from Luau, so they're like a. I have had them, um, but but I'm gonna give you like a review on them still. They're like I don't even know. It's like a baked. They're like baked M and M's. It's weird. It's, look at them. They're not colored or anything. They're like a baked shell M&M. I don't know. Maybe they're like healthier or something. They're not bad. It's not good. But they're not bad. Um, I'll give the... Uh, these ones are definitely well out of date. Yeah. Yeah, these are super expired. Um... <laughs> But uh, in their true, for, like in their good form, like when they're not expired, I, I'd give them like a six. I mean, they're obviously not as good as real M Ms, but they're they're fine. Uh, I'm not doing these again. You remember these? If you don't, uh, I'll put the video link in the description. Velveeta chocolate. Not doing that again. Uh, I have a shit ton of Snickers. I was gonna do a whole thing. I was gonna do a whole thing on Snickers, and. Uh, this is it, I guess. You're looking at it. Uh, this is the Snickers video, basically, because I guess I'll just do them all now. So first up, what is what is more interesting? Um, what the hell is that? Is that dragon fruit or something? I don't even know. Whatever this is, looks like maybe a dragon fruit of some kind. I'm going to get so sick. Ooh. Oh, that's weird. Because they're still like... Peanuts and stuff. I just, I'm just, these are old. So I'm glad they're not like weird colored. Oh, not dragon fruit. Passion fruit, I think. I think that's passion fruit. It's not very good. Fruit and nuts and chocolate don't mix to me. Unless it's just like chocolate covered strawberry. No, thank you. Ew. Um, I don't know, like a, it's not that like terrible, but it's not, it doesn't work. Like a five, I guess. I'll give it a five. Uh, next up, ooh, that one sounds good. I'll wait on that one. Pistachio. Oh, this one's gonna be bad. This one's lime. <laughs> Chocolate and lime, no good, not a good thing. There's a couple in here I'm gonna probably wanna keep and eat. You know, better than the last one. Only about a little bit. Not that bad. I'm trying to think of what it reminds me of. It's like a, um, ew. It gets worse. <laughs> it gets so much worse as I go on. It's like a, um, if you, hmm. If you take a, if you take a lime Skittle and you like dunk it in chocolate for whatever reason and throw some peanuts in there, that's what it would be like. It's a little better than the last one. I'll give it a six, but it's still pretty bad. I'd give it closer to a five, but since it was better than the one I gave a five, or actually, here's what I'll do. I'll bump the other one down to a four. I'll give that one a five because <laughs> the other one was pretty bad. The passion fruit or whatever. I don't even. I, I don't even know what that. That's what it was. Pistachio, butterscotch. That sounds good. Rocky Road, berry whip. Let's do. Let's do berry whip. Just get the fruit ones out of the out of the way. See, the problem is the nuts. <laughs> Not very good. It's not good. It's not great, but it's better than the other two. I just don't like fruit in my chocolate. It, it's weird. I don't like it. I don't like fruit in my chocolate. I just don't want it. I gotta get, I gotta, I'm gonna get a little water break here.
Now that I've got my uh, hydration in check, let's do uh, let's do pistachio. This one actually sounds pretty interesting. Case quesar pista. I believe it's pistachio. Yeah, definitely. This I think I think this is gonna be really good. So, I'd imagine they're using pistachios instead of peanuts. It is not good. <laughs> Ooh, it's actually really bad. That's horrible. It tastes like ew. I don't even know. I mean, it's got ew. <laughs> it's like fake pistachio flavor, but they could have just used real pistachios. I don't know if they did. I can't tell. Ew, it tastes like floor, like a like floor cleaner or something. No, I've never tasted floor cleaner, but it tastes like floor cleaner smells, but not like lemon floor cleaner. Just like ew. Kind of like a bleach. It tastes like bleach smells, kind of. Which is really not good. You don't want to eat bleach. Oh, I gotta, we have had some not good ones. Um, Three. That's the worst one. That's worse than the dragon fruit or passion fruit or whatever. That is so much worse. Alright, uh, let's do... I have high hopes for this one. Rock and Nut Road. Oh, this one looks... Expiry. Whatever. So what, does it have, like, marshmallow or something? I just don't know. Yeah. Yeah. It's like a little marshmallow -y, I guess. Not great. Honestly, I'm not, like, a Snickers guy in general. I'd rather have a Milky Way or a uh, Three Musketeer, you know? I, I, I like Snicker. I, I'll, I'll have it, but it's not a preferred thing. Let's go, um, oh, um. Uh, six it's fine it's not great let's go butterscotch this this should be really good i'm saving my favorite for last there's one more in here i'm saving saving for last Ooh, this smells good uh -oh. oh yeah that's the best one so far for sure for sure that's the best one all right Save my favorite for last, though. Or what I what I assume will be my favorite. We have coconut. I love... Controversial take here. I love coconut. I love everything coconut. I will eat coconut in anything, basically. So I have extremely high hopes for this. And I have one more coconut thing after this. Because I love coconut, man. Mm-hmm. That is delightful. <laughs> that is so good. It's like... I wish it had, I, I can't tell if it has actual coconut in it or not. Oh yeah, it does. That, it does. So, I'm going to give that one an 8. That's my favorite easily. Um, I'm going to give that one an 8. I love coconut. It's like kind of a a little toned down, like a, like a Mounds bar, but with peanuts. Which is pretty good. I like an Almond Joy, but peanuts instead of almond. And then these are the last one. Um, coconut M&M's. Inspired by the Candy Bounty, um, which I believe is also like an Almond Joy, I think. These, I'm extremely excited about. I think these are going to be delicious. And they're actually Almond Joy colored. You know what I think, though? I'm pretty sure they had an Almond Joy flavor M&M at some point. Maybe I made that up. but Or someone, something, did, did like an Almond Joy type M&M. And they were so good. So, I have high hopes. That's exactly what these are. I don't remember who made them, but yeah, those are pretty good. Uh, I'll put those on par with the Kit Kats. I wish it was a little more coconut, um, but they are pretty good. I'm I honestly just excited to throw out all this stuff. It's been in my pantry for a while, um, and it's time to go. It's time. It's time to boot it. Except for this. This you'll probably see fairly soon, because I gotta do it, and I'm not excited, but I gotta do it. All right, thank you for uh, checking this out, even though it's not like an official like food review. Just kind of like a get shit out of my pantry food, food review, you know? Uh, so, Betty White's still immortal. Goodbye.